What is up, guys? Welcome to a brand new episode of Roots of Pacha. Let's hop on into this. I see a lot of comments and a lot of love in the past couple episodes, so I really appreciate you guys watching those. I'm excited to hop on into this. Let's go talk to Oka. Last episode, we ended up um, giving the credits to get this quest. So how the system kind of works for your journal is you earn these money you earn money you give that money to the people and the people then build you something in this case we're doing animal domestication research is finished let's hop on into that i'm really excited to have you guys here for another episode as you guys know the devs have been nothing but cool with me and we're nice enough to uh, help me out with this game and the game's currently available on kickstarter so if you guys want to support the the cool devs of this game and also they are the devs of universe sim another great series on my channel which i do need to make more content for go check that out but let's hop on into this so we need to find oka and last episode i mentioned this but oka is one who teaches you how to tame animals but he's also wearing an animal skin and i don't think i like that idea but we won't talk too much about that this episode i was right uh told me that story again there was a time your ancestors imitated animals to get closer to their prey once they master their whistles the animals would stay no matter where they were watch these special animals and so instead of hunting them they chose to care for them somehow this was lost probably because we migrated somewhere and the animals didn't exist but then i thought about the flutes the ones that we use for rituals and dance some of them sounded like birds too i asked art acre is that is that really acre I think that's to make this special flute she brought them this morning let's check it out Ooh -hoo -hoo. why don't you try it and make some new friends so we have our flute i think that's probably on your two because it is a yeah so your two and metal middle mouse is pretty much all your tools and in this case it looks like it's going to be my flute and i think i did mention this previously the game has so much that's not currently in the game uh, this is going to be a shorter series, but we'll end up doing a huge series once the game gets more updates. But I just want to make sure you guys know that before you're like, Josh, it doesn't seem like there's a lot going on. The game's actually pre, I'm not sure if it's alpha or pre-alpha. I'm not sure which one. It's one of those two. It's either alpha or pre-alpha. Um, you can currently get the game, I believe, by supporting them on Kickstarter. You can buy a copy and they'll give you a code, I think. Pretty sure. Um, pretty sure that's how it works. Ooh, look at all this. Oh, that's going to be bank. It's going to be bank. Uh oh I didn't mean to play it, but it sounded pretty sweet. Don't mess with me and my flute ever again. Don't talk to me or my kids ever again. We gonna catch an ostrich. Oh, what's the mini game? Oh, jeez. Ah! Ah! Did I get that? Is that what you needed? I think I think I wasn't good enough. Let's try it again. Come on, love me. Adult ostrich, female, friendship, one heart. Do I have to play again for you? Will you love me? Someone love me. I ain't just doing this for the kicks. Ooh girl okay so it gets okay it's just a left click and it gets didn't get that i got that no baby young male all right all right we got a couple couple lads over here the cool kids live over here i got that that counts i think we probably have to get them to three hearts then maybe we can like I don't know. If we get them to three hearts, maybe you can ride them or something. I saw that there's races in this game. Spoiler. Uh, I think you're supposed to say that before you spoil it, but I said... Wait, hold up. I actually... Will you love me? Friendship, one heart. I have to see what else we can do to this thing. Anything? It doesn't seem like there's anything else we can do right now. I'm sure there is. I just don't know how to do it. Let's go look at... Okay. Idea finished. All right, so that's it for that. All right, all right. I'm sure there's something we're supposed to do with that. I just don't know what it is. But for now, let's finish uh, forging. I want to go collect all the other items out here if they are available. And also, I don't want to accidentally use that, so I'm going to just switch this. Because that's... The animation does take a few seconds there. If you just hover over it, it'll tell you if you can pick. On the bottom right, it says inspect. Or, I think, like, pick up or something. So, 
I don't actually need to click on everything before determining if I can. Like here it says harvest. Yep, harvest. Couple beet babies. Couple beet babies. All right, head over here. Harvest. And we're just going to be checking all these for a little bit because I want to make sure that we have enough money. I'd like to do my other quests. It's currently mid-afternoon. So I should head back to camp and just go turn on those other quests. But I just want to collect the rest of these just in case. And maybe we'll try and befriend these animals next. I still haven't even done the opening quests, I got to be honest. So I should head back and go start those. Those opening quests were... Um, you came with two quests right off the bat. You hit your J. I think one was about the water skin. And then maybe what the other one was about something else. But the people at the town should be able to help me. You just had to get credits credits is that what they call it in this something like that and then you had to get some stone for the other mission so let's see if we have everything we need to complete those and if we do we're good if we don't then we'll figure it out i am excited to see where this game goes these early access games are always a lot of fun can i just try and can I play you all the flute one more time hold up let me let me play you the flute okay listen to this No, it doesn't seem anything. Ooh. Doesn't seem fancy right now, but I'm sure. Y'all sound great over there. That was my attempt at doing whatever noise they make. I know it's probably a bad attempt. I apologize. You had to hear that. But no one over here wants my attention, right? Nope. I do love that on the map it shows you where everyone is. That is one of the hardest struggles with finding everyone. It is a struggle. Let's head back into town, and what we still need to do is water all our plants, and then let's go turn on those quests real quick. Let's go talk to everyone. So who do we still need to talk to? I don't like that once you start the quest, they move here, but I want to talk about that. Uh, Maria and Igrok. Maria is over there, and Igrok should be over. Where's Igrok? He's an old man, right? Oh, right there. Oh, we can hit both those real quick. Run, 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 run. Go hit those up real quick. See what they're doing. She has wings. I like your wings. Oh, it'll be good to harvest. Oh, it's not good. To har that definitely looks good to harvest, but we won't talk about it. You don't want to be harvested. We don't. Why did I? Oh, that's okay. I overshot it. That's all right. These look still watered, but I'm not sure how often you need to water all the plants. I'm not sure if it's a daily thing like Stardew or every other day. The soil does look wet to me, though. Oh, wait, you have to right-click. No, wait. No, no, no. Maybe, yeah, right-click him and then hit discuss ideas. 75 and then 20. We're going to say let's do it. We'll be working on this idea. So he's going to start working on that new idea we had. I'm assuming that idea is a well because it says it's a well, but he could spook me up with something new. Who knows? Let's try and water and see if it looks. Okay, we'll have to hit these layers with some water there. Make sure everything's watered. Yeah, please give me that well. I don't want to have to go run out of the water just to keep doing this. There's fishing in this game. I don't know how that mini game works. Let's go check it out real quick. We already checked out the animals and tried playing a little little flute action for the animals. You know, start doing some animal taming. I like that you don't just buy animals in this, but instead you catch them. It's a different concept than Stardew, which I think... Uh, those Stardew is freaking amazing. I don't think you should always copy them. Are you supposed to sit here and like wait? No? That wasn't it. Oh, hold up. So you sit here and then you wait for something. I just don't know what I'm waiting for. So it comes by. Am I supposed to... Oh. Oh! Gotcha. So you hover over it with your left click until it centers in, then you left click. So you hover over it. You don't hover it over it with your left click. You just hover over it until it kind of focuses on the target. Then you click and it and it catches the, the bad boy, the Larry, if you will. All right, let's go ahead over and drop this stuff off real quick. This is like where you turn in stuff at the nights. 
at the nights. Drop, drop. This was all stuff we forged today, and it actually looks like forging does make you mucho dolores, so I don't mind doing that. That's, it actually seems worth it in this game. Though I'm sure having a crap ton of plants is better. Um, I still think um, there's a big benefit to this. Oh, we still have a we have a bunch of new uh, vegetables we can plant. I know it's late, but I'm going to do it real quick. If I have time, I'm going to plant everything. Ah! Don't break your plant. Perfect. Perfect two runner there. And then we can probably use the rest of our energy just to smash some rocks. I don't know if the night shuts you off eventually, I'm assuming. But I have no evidence to prove otherwise right now. So let's just clear out some as much space as we can until the night's over. Or until it kicks us out. Whichever comes first. This is probably something we should have done one of the earlier days, but you know me, man. I get I get sidetracked, especially when uh, making content, man. Whenever I'm making YouTube videos, I really get sidetracked. Thank you guys so much for tuning on into this episode, by the way. I know these episodes, we usually only do one day in, but I'm, in the future, we'll end up making them like half hour, probably two, maybe even three day episodes. But for now, I kind of want to focus on one topic each episode, give us the opportunity to kind of learn that topic, see how that functions, and and kind of wrap it up for the next episode. Next episode, we'll have that well done, which will be cool. I'm not sure if irrigation is an irrigation system, which you could see in my last thumbnail, episode two's thumbnail. Um, there's an irrigation system, which is pretty cool. I don't know if that's currently in the game, but I'm sure we'll find out. We need an improved tool. I wonder if improved tools are added to the game yet. I'm sure we'll find out eventually. Anyways, guys, I think we're going to wrap it up here. Let's finish this off. And I'm going to go run inside, see how much money we made. Because we probably made mucho. Mucho Dolores, you know? I think that's it. Let's leave that alone. Look at how much space we cleared. Look at all that inventory items. Let's go ahead to sleep. And then see how much money we made. And we'll wrap this episode. Mm. Thank you guys so much for watching another episode of Roots of Pacha. If you want to support them, there's a link to their Kickstarter down in the description. It's still pre-early access. It's like pre-alpha i think is what they call it it's pretty much just a test version where they have a lot of the basics in there but there's going to be so much more added as the game continues to be developed we made 60 which isn't as much as i thought we'd make yeah that wasn't as much as i was hoping but i guess 60 is not bad we spent 75 today though so we are minus 20 uh 15 on the day but for now, guys, thank you so much for watching and supporting the content. Please consider looking down below and hit that spicy subscribe button. Like, comment, do all that stuff, and I will catch you in the next episode. Thanks, guys.